I'm in the darkroom at Melbourne Polytechnic and I'm going to show you my solution for tray developing in a very cold room because it's winter here in Melbourne and it's very difficult to keep your temperatures up. Although it's generally not critical for paper development, if your developer temperature is going to drop below 16 degrees, you're probably never going to achieve full development, even if it's extra strong and you give it extra time. I've taken an old tray and I've I've glued in some baffles to uh, suspend the developing tray up above a solution of warm water. The point is, uh, your developer can be correct temperature, let's say it's 20 degrees. If the room is very cold, you might want to make a solution of water up that's 21 degrees and fill it up. Now I've also drilled a bunch of drainage holes all the way around because the main sink isn't completely flat for drainage. You need the drain holes so you don't have too much water in here which would cause your tray of developer to actually float around like a boat. It would rock and it would actually spill developer into your warm bath. Now if the room is very cold and everything is going to chill down you could just take some hot water and pour it into there to bring the temperature up. Uh, rock this tray to stir it in. Um, some excess is going to pour out of the drain holes. You know, be careful, it's very easy to pick, make the temperature too high in here. And as this fluid contacts the bottom of this tray, the temperature will lift up in here.